Okay, this is the vacuum chamber that I got from the ambulance parts and this actually this is um, the water trap and it's actually a piece of solid uh, of a tubular plexiglass uh, thick like quarter inch um, it's actually machined out with a groove here it's super high quality uh, and there's a bracket to attach it to the ambulance which I'll use I'm going to put a rod on this and attach it to my um, uh, chemistry set there and then all you do is put this in uh, and again it's got a machined uh, groove in this top piece of plexiglass with a big o-ring in it everything's machined in there which is really nice so it plugs onto here okay and uh, as you can see uh, it gives me the vacuum gauge that I want um, and on like a pressure gauge it's all in reverse so you know, normally a pressure gauge is like this and it goes in this direction this one is going to be pulled in the reverse direction but it's just basically a backwards board and tube um, and I've got some pictures of that I can show you but basically there's a tube in it for the trap this is where this, uh, the suction comes where you attach your suction pump I don't know why they didn't make this like a Christmas tree thing with knurling on it it's kind of smooth but it does work uh, and it just opens down there on a, f on a flared end so that the suction comes out, you know, not from the bottom where the where it might get, you know, s suck crap into the thing. And here's the thing that's really great is this is what goes to uh, the equipment that I have that wants to take the suction. Notice it's all the way at the top. So, um, Actually, I said that wrong. Um, well, I mean, you can put it either place you want, but uh, you want to put the suction here. Yeah, I said that backwards. And your device here so that any water that falls in um, or comes in here won't get sucked back up here, whatever. And this is a valve which opens and closes this uh, selectively, you know, to exit or actually input it. This is the... Yeah, this should be the vacuum coming in, or vacuum being pulled out, whatever. Uh, and uh, and this, of course, this clamp just holds this tight. But once a vacuum goes in it, it uh, it you can't you couldn't break this seal if you wanted to. And that's again another benefit of the valve is it allows me to have a way to break the seal in my um, setup. So I'm gonna go ahead and plug this into the pump, and I'll show you how it works.